sure. Audio is working. Okay, it's working this time. I don't know if 8 decibels is loud enough or not, though. Maybe I should put it a little bit louder, even though there's echo. Just to, like, make it better. I don't know. Like, 12 decibels, maybe. T test. Oh yeah, I have my TV muted by accident. Test. Okay, we are going to finish the game. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I raised it a couple decibels, but it shouldn't be too loud. Okay, let's put this, get the show on the road. We are finishing the game. And thankfully, it's still bruh. Stopped with that joke. That joke is so bad, Elphilin, I swear. That does- it doesn't even make sense. Gotch? Why is it- why- why? What? Why? Okay. Okay, we are doing the rest of these cool levels. And then probably, hopefully, the true arena. Let's go, Forgo Wasteland. Boom. Gonna try to cram all this into one stream. And if not, your money back, I guess. You better give it with the money back guarantee. Okay. Also, just, you know, Goku shirt because I feel like it. You know, I feel like Goku on this stream. I'm going to my absolute limit and I'm being the game. You know, or something. I don't know. Boom. I'll also not rush, because I still want to explore the level. Thoroughly enough. Oh, hold up. I got the DM. Okay. It was a funny meme. Oh man, this is gonna be a terrifying map to frickin' find the souls in. Who do they think I am? Okay. Oh god. Well, that's fun. Okay. There's a soul in one of these, right? No, it's just coins. Just coins. Where are all the souls? I demand souls. Souls, come unto me. That is a reference to Soul Calibur, by the way. Nightmare says it. He's he's epic and cool. Ow. I like Nightmare. He's like one of my mains. Even though I haven't played it in like 20 years. Simply because he is cool looking. Okay, let's go, Kirby. Kirby forklift. Ow. I kind of miss hearing those Waddle Dees go, wah, wah, wah. It was cute and wholesome. Okay, where are all the souls? Am I missing any? Probably. Nothing over here. Screw it. Come on. Give me more souls. Oh, that's a good reward. I like that. The post-post game will be upgrading all the abilities to max level. That'll be my post-post game. Off-stream, of course. It's too late, Kirby. I am forklift certified. Oh my god! Ah. <laughs> I love the forklift certified meme. It's so funny and random. Ah, you frick. I'm glad the game still remembers the items I got, even though, you know, I exited. Like, I still have the health bar and the other thing. It's nice. Dun 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 Ow. That bomb does not know what it's doing. Ow. 
Ow. What the? Okay, I gotta, I gotta get out of here. No, don't destroy me. I need my health. Okay, boom. I don't know if I was supposed to even beat this boss, but here they are. Oh, okay, they gave me a soul. Yeah, I know, right? I hate that. Even though lives don't matter, like, come on, man. Why would they do that? Like, even games that were, like, modern era games. Like, Return to Dreamland. I'm pretty sure Return to Dreamland reset your life count. Like, come on, man. This is a modern era game. Do not reset my life counter. I don't care if lives are completely worthless in Kirby. Do not reset it. I, I like seeing the numbers go up. Even though they are completely useless. In Kirby games. Also, I'm glad they did away with life. Because as I stated, they are not needed. Except maybe in Kirby's like Dreamland. Because that's kind of a harder game, honestly. Kirby Streamline is slightly difficult, especially in hard mode. Yeah, I know, right? It had 80 million lives. <laughs> it was so funny. I hope more games have these cool shop things, because, like, you know, the game did away with lives and have, has, you know, a coin shop system thing. That's cool. Do more stuff like that. The only a huge missed opportunity, they don't have colors. Alternate colors for Kirby. Like, this is a game where you have to hunt down wallabies and stuff, but you like you can't collect treasure or something, like Amazing Mirror of Street Squad. Like, that was such a genius idea. Why did they never do it again? I wanna see Kirby but green, okay? I wanna see Kirby but green or char propellered. It was like the most genius idea of those games. You can change her Kirby color. It was so cool. Like, come on, man. Test. Okay, we are in this level now. Uh, I don't care what people say about Sweet Sweat, honestly, I enjoyed that game. It was fun. Then again, it was like the first Kirby 2D platform I played since, like, um, Nightmare in Dreamland on the Game Boy Advance. And I guess maybe part of Kirby 64. Because I didn't really play the older game otherwise. I mean, I played a little bit of Superstar, but I didn't really, I didn't really play Superstar until the, the DS game, so. Like, that was my true introduction. Oh yeah, and I dabbled very little bit into Dreamland 3. Because, like, my brother had a Super Nintendo, and there was Superstar and Dreamland 3 on it, but, like, I didn't play those a ton. Just like how I didn't play Super Mario World a ton. Like, I was more of a Sega Genesis guy, honestly. Of the, si of the two systems that my brother had. Of older games. Like, I played more random Genesis games. Like, Gunstar Heroes, and, like... Sonic 3, and also, yeah, I never played Amazing Mirror, so... That was like five years in between my last 2D Kirby, basically. Yeah, but I also didn't play the old games, so... I mean, not really. Oh yeah, what am I missing here? I'll figure it out. Oh wow, they're trying to be sneaky. Oh yeah, no, uh, there was also the anime, which is cool. I watched that quite a bit as a kid, but I don't really remember a lot of the episodes. It was just cool, though. I mean, to be fair, I don't really remember a lot of Sonic X either, even though that's like... 
a thing. Oh yeah, I should kill the frog down there. He'll probably give me a soul or something. Poor kid was cool. I don't care what people say. You know, honestly, in terms of dubbed anime, I didn't really watch any of their dubs other than, like, Pokemon, Sonic X. Yeah, I mean... We never got to adventure. We never. We never even finished Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. We skipped like part of that, and then we watched. I think a little bit of Sad I Am, and that was it. So like, yeah, the Mario song was like more complete. We just dipped very little into Sonic. Like we did. We didn't do it for a bit, but we never really tried that again. So I do want to like. One of these days, it's just hard, because we never really have time to watch, like, big series like that again now. Sadly. We still gotta watch more Namek, too. Wait, where- Oh, Philin, what am I missing here? Am I missing anything? I didn't see him say anything, but I don't know. Ah! Uh, I see. I see now. I see it now, I think it's all clear to me. Speaking of Sonic, I'm... Probably, honestly, I kind of want to play another platformer after this. I know that's, like, kind of silly, but I honestly just want to get the Sonic Adventure already. Like, the Sonic movie is making me hype to play a Sonic game, so, like... I feel like it's nice to do while the iron is hot. Or whatever. I kind of want to play more Scrimlo games, like... Okay, actually, I still have to beat Symphony of the Night, but, like... Otherwise, like... Oh, I'm gonna play more Scrimlo games. Say I have lack of variety or something, whatever, but, like, to be fair, most of my channel, other than the occasional RPG, it's gonna be lots of Scrimlo-type games, because that is the kind I like. We love Scrimlos. Okay, we're in the mall now, I guess. I like how I just call them Scrimlo. Okay. Ranger, oh yeah. Space Ranger Kirby or Among Us or something, I don't know. I'm not even gonna use that cutter. Boom. This was one of my favorite levels, honestly, because it, like, utilized all of the frick- Like, a lot of the frickin', um, mouthful transformations at once, and did it- did them in cool ways. Oh, at least it didn't give me only three this time, like, come on, man. Do I need this over here? Probably not. I think the word you're looking for is Space Ranger. Wait, I think I'm missing something. Hmm. Oh, I can't even get up there. Yeah, I'm not missing anything. Let's go, Kirby! Oh, crap. Am I gonna need this for something? Do 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 do. Bruh. We are ice cream. I mean, not. I mean, we're a vending machine and we're candy. We're invincibility candy. Hopefully, I don't really need this. For, like, any secret soul. Probably not. Bro, it's Pac-Man!
Honestly, I never really used this power up too. I mean, power too extensively in like non boss contacts. He ate lean. He loves lean. I don't know. Old joke and meme already, but like it's fun. I think it's kind of funny. So, lean. Ow. Ow. Um, can I die? Probably a freaking No. The lean has to kill me, I'm sorry. I don't want to go too far. I don't think the ring was... A the ring's not going to respawn. I, I just... Freaking somehow forgot. I'm sorry. It didn't save when I got that soul, did it? It probably did. But, I mean, even if it did, the, the ring's probably still going to respawn if I die, so... Just keep doing what you do best, Kirby. Die. And then we'll top it off by going into lean. Uh, yeah, it spawned me over here, but I don't think that matters. Um, am I screwed? Am I screwed? Let's see. Let's find out. Where's the freaking power up I need? Honestly, it was probably a soul, and I'm angry. Because the game just did an unwinnable scenario for me if I freaking accidentally got rid of a freaking mouthful object. Like, come on, man. Now I'm just gonna look everywhere just to make sure there's no freaking thing I have to use the cone on here. Anger. No, there's nothing to use the cone on here. Yeah. Oh my god, the thing is, this room is so big too. How will I... Uh, I might as well just Google it. If I waste... Because I don't want to waste too much of my time here. Chess. Okay, I probably, probably am not screwed, I think. Yeah, okay, it was probably just coins. I'm overreacting a little bit here. But I'm still kind of nervous about it for some reason. I don't need this thing for anything else, right? No, I meant the freaking treasure chest I just skipped. Because there's no raid. Oh. Actually, you're right. Okay, I didn't know there wasn't any more souls. Thank you, Nex. You saved the day. I thought there would be more than that, to be honest with you. Also, another frickin' candy! Let's go!
I'm gonna bring it with me to the boss. You, you never know. Let me do the boss. Don't waste my time. Oh crap. Wait, what? No, I want it sleep. Oh. Wait. I got all the, the... I thought it would just bring me... Okay, I don't know what I was thinking. Dang. Okay, I didn't screw myself there either, I think, right? He said I got all the things. I think. But I wanted to explore the rest of that room, but it's whatever, I don't care. Probably just some coins. Dang it. Now I'm just freaking panicking for no reason because of the stupid thing I did. That wasn't that stupid, but it could have been. I'm panicking, man. I'm shook. So it's close. It could have been bad. Gordo, uh, tilt stage flashbacks. People will never look at Gordo the same way again. I am now forklift certified. No, oh, scissor lift. Close enough. I am now scissor lift certified. Oh my god, that is violent. Wee. No, I want the figurine. Eh, whatever. I'll just pay more money to get it. No, I want all the figurines. It's good that none of them are exclusive to any levels, or otherwise I'd just die. I'm glad all Kirby games have this, like, thing you can collect now that's different characters kind of thing. Like, frickin' keychains, stickers, all that jazz. Or puzzle pieces, but those aren't as... I, I, I think the stickers and keychains were kind of cooler than the puzzle pieces, but the puzzles are cool when you complete them. So I guess I'll give it that. Oh, yo, we're fighting Silly Dolo already? Oh, wait, no, we're not. I'm silly. Wait, what is this level? I don't even... Oh, wait, I remember now. It just didn't do this gimmick with Dark Fire, so... It's almost like a new level. It's also kind of reminding me of that freaking 3D Land Zelda level. Where you had the late higher with the Fireball, Mario. Fire Mario, whatever, I don't care. Yep. Hello? Anybody? You can't see shit in Detroit. Oh. Okay, there we go. It's like that freaking crash level. With the Firefly. It's even desert themed. That's how you know it's like that crash level. Bruh, why do they get rid of your power as soon as you instantly touch a spike? Ugh. This is annoying. The moment you touch a spike, it just gets rid of your power. Aha! Don't think I'm missing anything otherwise. Keep going. Oh, you little. Kirby doesn't jump high enough in this game, man. 
I keep thinking he's gonna flow higher, fly higher, and he's he just doesn't. Like I get it, they want it to not be too OP because it's 3D, but like it's gotta like sometimes it doesn't let you go the height you want, and it's like ugh. Okay, this is slightly annoying. Oh, they're gonna have me fight a Frosty or something. Wait. Ah! Found a secret. Yo. Oh, no frosty. Just a ring. Ah, crap. He blows out the fire, too. Okay, let's fight Silly Delo. In spoopy mode. Wait, ah, crap, I lost my power. Okay, well, you know what that means. Kirby! Oh, bro, they just have all the powers right here. Let's fight using Among Us, Kirby. Oh my god, he is scary. I wonder if his dancing partner looks different. Oh crap, I didn't mean to use that immediately. Oh, whoops, I'm stupid. Oh bruh, his sides are all neon. Wait a minute, what if I break all of his... Oh. Well, never mind. Honestly, he looks kind of like a FNAF character. And now that he has those eyes. More dodging, huh? Oh, what the heck? That's kinda cool. Boom. We beat them, boys. Oh, wait, I forgot to say that it was the finale. Well, I think it can be reasonably assumed that this is the finale. 
Let's get this bread. Let's get this dough. Oh, look here. We got another freaking view bot. Let's destroy them. Ah, crap. I don't want this on the screen. Okay, hold on. Learn Eminence, as predicted. Forgo Zone. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, there's three levels. Get in the zone, Forgo Zone! I don't know. We got 51. It's very purple here. Oh, different music. I guess we don't need to collect more soul pieces after this. I presume. Yo, wait! This... I know this song. I was thinking about this song the other day, too, because it's honestly one of my favorite songs from Return to Dreamland. It's so cool. This song doesn't really do remix as much. I mean, this game doesn't do remix as much, but when it does, you got you got good ones. Oh god, no, I don't want my power to be gone. Wait, I didn't collect all the souls. Oh, there's one right there. No, it's still, I'm still missing one. Well, boys, we're going on a wild goose chase. Where is the soul I'm missing? Oh, wait. I know where. It's probably up on that thing. I see what they're doing now. They are not so clever! Now I have... Ah. Uh, you know what? No. Wait a minute. Oh, Phyllis was already cold. Oh, wait. No, never mind. I forgot that... The, the enemies are called Phantoms, not Forgo. I was gonna say, what if it's Forgo Forgo, I felt this. Ah. Well, I feel like I know where one might be. Because of the way I got one of the freaking Waddle when I played this level the first time. Like, I didn't even do it the intended way. 
Because basically, there was like a bomb lock on a wall, and there was a waddle dee. Wait, oh, I see one. There was a freaking bomb lock on a wall, and there was a waddle dee. And they wanted me to break it to get the waddle dee in the building. But what I did was I jumped out the building and just looked around to see if there's anything in the blind spot that he missed. And I found the waddle dee that way because I was just flying off the freaking top of this building. It was pretty funny. Do I need this? Time Crasher? Oh, huh? Bomb block? Yeah, speaking of bomb blocks, did I miss it? I probably did. Let's just kill everything. For fun. I'll do it the old fashioned way. AKA circle around this tower until I find a blind spot. This is how I found Waldy. Um, I don't know where that bomb block you mentioned was. Ah, oh, not so sneaky. I'm just gonna go down here. Wait, was I down here before? Maybe I skipped this area. Oh, sneaky. Sneaky. Camera trickery right here. Yeah, I skipped that area by accident, I guess. So, good thing I checked. Not that I wouldn't have anyway, because El Phyllis is based. Now he suddenly has the power to detect souls, so... I mean, hey. That's cool. Oh, this factory. One of the hardest stages in the game, for sure. And now it's even more annoying. Kirby! You know what I need right now? Boom. Thank you, Meta Knight. Maybe that will help. No, it didn't. It didn't really help. I thought maybe it would do something. Nothing up here. Ah, crap. Dang, I lost my only... Okay. Oh. We got another one.
I mean, I guess that's probably fair. But that's so slow. Mm. There's gotta be a soul. Yeah. Oh. Wait a minute. I know what I'm freaking missing. Ah. I, I gotta speed through the last freaking level. I forgot the freaking special stones were in these levels. Dang it. I'm sure that's an easy Google search, and also the level probably doesn't take more than like three minutes to beat without. Wait, I got the stone from the desert? Are you sure? Cause I don't know. I don't remember where I was if I did. Like, I guess I kind of just keep collecting these things and not noticing. Or what? But... So right now I have ten of them. Oh wow, this is going to help me. Wait, these are here? <laughs> yeah, so true. Where was the last one, if I may ask? Because I don't know. I want to know what I did. Maybe it was when I was panicking about the one treasure chest, and I was like, oh no. And then it meant nothing. Imagine if it was in that chest. And that was the thing I was missing. Oh wait, duh, no, no, no. Let's not repeat the mistakes of the stream. Of the first time I went through this level. I already forgot how to do it. Boom. Where was the stone? Wait, no. This is like a mini boss. Boom. Oh. Oh yeah, it was the one that was freaking um the ring, right? I don't know. Oh yeah, now I remember. Bruh. Okay, that's funny that I forgot. My mind keeps complaining them with like three tier like soul things. And I'm like, oh I got three souls, but I didn't get three souls. I actually got a stone. Best ability ever. I wonder if the sword beam working with two health bar. Um. Crap. And there's no way of knowing if I got it or not. Without, like, playing through my stream like 10 hours. Wait a minute, Elf Villain didn't say anything about my thing. Okay, wait. Hello there. Ah, oh, I found your secrets, game. You can't fool me. Yeah, I was gonna say, brah, come on, they could have hit a second one up here, just to be even more doofish. Yeah, I know, but it looks like the end. Bruh, look at Meta Knight's mask. I 
Oh no, it's one of these things. Let's freaking go. Oh god. Ah. Uh... I'm mad if there is. Gosh darn it! I hate everything right now. Oh wait. It's over here, isn't it? Good. Money. Yo, extra Chungusy Kirby here. It's a lot of water. Oh yeah, this level. Oh wow, they want me to do a boss with this guy. Let's go. I wish you had more chances to fight bosses with these things, because it is kind of fun. Double sword. This icky pain like goop! It's moving! Bruh, extra chungacy. Honestly, I like the B-Bind controls because it just. It, it, I'm used to playing Crash Bandicoot, so it's just like playing Crash. It's X the jump equals B to jump. And it's simple. This game is basically Kirby Crash, so it works. Yo, more opportunities to use the mouthful in bosses. Just what I asked for. Though it's ring again, so points off for unoriginality. Kappa. Points off for unoriginality. Oh, do I get to fight a boss with a freaking soda machine? Let's go. Vending machine. Ow.
Okay, when can I use Forklift Certified Kirby to fight a boss? That's pretty neat. Okay, hope I'm not missing anything. Oh, idea time. Dang. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Ah, damn it. I'm surprised there aren't, like, any traditional... Well, actually, not traditional. Because, like... I'm surprised there aren't, like, any eShop game in the sky, in the skies type games in this game. Like, there isn't an, um, frickin' Robobot and Triple Deluxe. Starlight's, um, sub-games are more self-contained, like, the usual type of Kirby sub-game, but, like... I mean, you'd think this game would be the perfect opportunity. To do it like a Kirby Blowout Blast sequel because it's in 3D already, but I guess not. Kirby's Blowout Blast 2. Okay, good. I got everything. Eshop Game Pilot episode. That's what I'll call it. We're gonna fight a lot of souls now. Eh, let's see with spikes. Yo, be but epic. Okay, let's a little bit. Oh my God! This is the freaking Bowser's Mario 64 2 bo boss battle. I mean. Bowser 2 Mario 64 boss battle. That's what this is. Phantom Forgo DDD is not two words I thought I would see together. Wow, he's actually harder than the original fight. Not a surprise, but, like, he dies really quickly, usually. Phase two. Oh, yeah. Okay, they still play the song. Oh, my God. Yo, hey, that's my power. Ah, you little. But I have fire hammers too. Oh yeah, I didn't really think about it, but. The fire in this ability comes from DDD. I didn't didn't really think about that for some reason. Probably because I beat him so quickly, so I didn't really even realize how extensively he used fire in this fight. I know it was an objective. Bruh, he didn't even get to do whatever that attack was. So sad. Yo. We got him. Now we have to fight Illusion Leon Gar. Or Phantom, I mean. Wait, that isn't the end. Right? right? Oh. No. Okay, I thought there would be two bosses for some reason. You know what? Let me just Google real quick where that freaking Ice World stone is. Before I forget about it.
Yay, I saved his soul. Yo. I like how it always let has me wait before it completes the fanfare. Oh, yep, yeah, bruh. This is gonna explain their relationship, isn't it? Wait, Carol? Bruh. What? Wait, was, was, um, Flowerline the queen? Leon and Carol. These two were the famous leaders of the Carol Animal Kingdom. Until Leon found ID F86. Oh, 86. There's that number again. After that, he began speaking a language Carol couldn't understand. She only speaks in meows, Mara, and formed the brutal beast pack. She still believed in him, so she formed a new identity of her own and followed along. Aww. So, yeah, basically these two are a couple. I knew it. I knew it. The lore. Your reward for 100% completing the souls is lore. Thank you. Yo, okay, I'm gonna Google stuff real quick. If a wish pops up of mine in Moon Eye, let me know, by the way, Kappa. Yeah, just gonna Google this real quick. Just to make sure. Four grown horns wear rare stone. Oh, I have to put fires out in the side area. Does that sound familiar? I don't know if I did that. I forget what happened in the last episode, obviously. Other than getting souls. Rare stone. Okay, wait. Oh yeah, I think I got it. This seems familiar. Let me just send a screenshot in the DM. Did I- I think I did this, right? Because I think I recognize that area. Oh wait, maybe I didn't. I don't know. I'll just do it later. Don't know. That's probably just me thinking of the original level. Dang it. Okay. Well, good thing you reminded me. Because I will be sad infinitely. If I don't... Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll do that after the true arena if I have time. Oh god. Does this game just get creepier? Is it gonna somehow make it creepier than the freaking fusion thing? Oh god, I'm, I'm, I don't like this. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. Here we are. I'm afraid again. All over again, I'm afraid. For a second, I thought it said, End the Bite of 86! Is that the Bite of 86? Yo. Oh, so that's what that post credit scene me meant. Oh, he's so cute! Look at this little bean! Little bean! Oh, Wait, Leon's a good guy now? Am I gonna fight him? Oh, he looks so cute now. He's wholesome. He's gonna be good, right? Oh, okay, that's it! We did it! We beat the game! Oh my god, he's dancing! I love it! Oh no! Okay, I knew it was gonna... I knew it was gonna... 
freak out on possessed beast. Poor go Leon. He doesn't look as scary as I thought though. Bruh, who needs these chumpy abilities? Yeah, that's so cute. He was just like Bruh. Okay. Kirby powers. Activate! Who needs these chumpy powers? Oh, okay. Maybe I do need them. Maybe they were better. I don't think I have the experience to fight him with this. Properly, anyway. Okay, well... You know what? Actually, screw, screw DDD. He's, he's making this fight seem like a joke. I want this to be climatic, okay? Skip the cutscene. Do all this over again. I need the proper power for the fight. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. I feel bad by using hammer, so I'm gonna do it again. Thank you. Oh, Alphilin gave me that. Instead, I will just use- wait, oh. Instead, I will use this. Which is kind of chumpy, but slightly less chumpy. And here we are. Oh my god. Also, Sonic movie soon. I'm so hyped. I wonder how much longer it'll take me to beat Symphony of the Night. Yo. Yeah, like, DDD already put him at that much health. So, I don't want to use that. I want to see all of his moves. So I'm prepped for the arena, man. Even though the arena won't be that hard either, because I'm gonna super beef myself up for it. I'm gonna give Kirby steroids. And here we are, and here we are, and here we are, and here we are, and he is dead. And not really. Oh my god, wait, am I actually fighting that thing? Like, the creepy form of that guy? Oh, never mind. Okay, he, there's more. There's more. Do, 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 do. I don't know why I sing, keep singing that song. I just like it, man. Yo. He is strong. He is strong, man. I want someone to make a Leongar skin for the guy in Rivals Vaser, though. Also, I should stream Rivals Vaser. Why didn't I think of that? It's a fun game. I don't know what I would do in it specifically, but, like, there's a lot of content for me to play with. Like, I have the workshop stuff. Also, you should probably get that game. I mean, don't know when we would play it, but it is definitely super fun. Especially with mods and all the stuff that comes with those. Like, it's crazy. Okay. Do 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 Oh my god, he's kicking my butt. I need more Kirby's. Pronto. We need more Kirby's. Honestly, I thought this was be like a full level, but no. That's okay. Oh crap. 
I want to fight that thing. What do you mean? It's targeting him. Oh my god. It's targeting him. Okay, that's all I need. So maybe I would have been better well off with... Cutter. I don't know. Why did freaking Elphalan give me the worst abilities in history? Why did you give me the worst abilities, Elphalan? Oh, crap. Well, I'm on my own. Somehow normal is stronger. Normal is stronger than bomb. Oh my god. Oh crap, it's in the Avatar Awakening state. Oh shoot, I get the fight. That thing. Wait, butterflies? What? It's gonna eat it. Bro, he looks so goofy there. Wait, what? Oh crap. Wait, what? Why is he more for that? Okay. I don't know this guy's lore. I didn't play the other modes of Star Allies. I'm gonna have to get up to speed later. Who is this guy? Oh man. I don't have a power either. Dang it, now I wish I used freaking. Um, what's it called? Um, Cutter. Why won't Amiibo give me powers? Yo. Well, what does Morphine I have to do with any of this? I don't know who this guy is, so... Um... Okay, sure. Let's fight this guy. You might need to explain some context here. I mean, I could just play Star Allies, but like, that's probably not for a while, so... And I probably don't really care about spoilers, so like... I need to know the lore. Who is this guy? Why is he a butterfly? What does he have to do with this whole guy? Oh, okay. So, wait, who the heck is Morpho? I don't know who that is either. It sounds like some Scrimload here lore. Oh yeah, I also don't know, like, really a lot about the frickin... Bro Robot lore. I know that game added a lot into lore too, so... I know there's like something called the Star Dream, and that's kind of all I know. I don't know, they made it crazy. Yo. Bruh. Soul Forgo is lunch. Boom. Yo. This guy's got big swords. Oh my god, this is trippy. What? What the? This is trippy, man. Can I have fire ability by eating you? Okay, that wasn't very smart. Gosh, this is messing me up. Massive. What if I just turn my head sideways? Oh. Well, too late for that. Crap.
Wait, I used both of them already? Um, Richter, give me your power. Samus, give me your power. I don't know, all I got out of that was there's a butterfly and he turned into this guy. I don't really know what who he is. Not the slightest clue because I haven't played Robobot and I don't think he was in Triple Deluxe and I'm pretty sure he first appeared in Star Allies, so like I'm a little out of the loop. Cool stuff though. Oh, bruh, a butterfly? Eat souls? What kind of freaking What? Man, Kirby is wacky. This guy eats souls, he's a butterfly. They made a butterfly in your old meta I designed and made it the sickest design, you, sickest character you've ever seen. Is that what- Nope, turned my head sideways so I could actually play the game. May cause minor neck irritation. Wait a minute. I have a smart idea. <laughs> okay, wait. Maybe not so smart. Crap. Okay, wait. <laughs> this is how we're doing it. I'm looking at my freaking OBS window and playing the game. Genius. Also, I'm sideways now. <laughs> Wait, he was gonna be in Kirby GCN? Okay, this is actually kinda working. I'm cheating the game. Oh, never mind. That didn't last long. No, so Sakurai was actually gonna bring this back. At least, I assume Sakurai had to do with Kirby GCN, but I don't know. Oh, wow. Did I win? Is that it? I mean, he was there at the time. I think. Actually, Kirby GCN was, um, 2005. So maybe he wasn't involved. I don't know. Yo! Okay. That's what you meant. Morphinite Sword. Let's go! We saved him. I think. Oh no, he's dead! <laughs> well, the GCN project might not have been completed, but... Oh, that's so wholesome! Oh, they got all the guys! The boys! Wholesomeness. Sakurai might not have been involved, but he did use models of, from it for some reason in Brawl. For the trophies of Kirby. And also, let's just have him over here. Because this cutscene's epic. Oh, is this guy a good guy now? I guess maybe just searching for the specimen made him go crazy or something. Oh, bruh. It's kind of like frickin', what's it called, um, Pokemon. Like, Lusamine from Pokemon goes frickin' crazy trying to get, like, Ultra Beast or something, right? Except she was also just a bad person. Aww. Wholesome. Okay, I guess we actually beat the game this time. Kind of, except we still need to do the true arena. Wait, they're having me go through the credits again? Bruh. So... I guess that's fine. There's new pictures this time. 
I think. So let's look at them all. Do 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 bruh. That is a top tier picture. Do 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 Let's go. It's awesome aim. Pop. I don't know where I'd rank it still. I'll have to give it some time, but I would definitely say it's like up there with Robobot, Superstar Ultra, Return to Dreamland. All those games. Bro, that is a quality screenshot. Bro, the elf one. The bean. We love him. We love them. Wait a minute, where is El Phyllis though? I don't think the arena's canon, right? Probably not. I guess that's all the story of this game. Maybe. I wonder why this guy isn't even in the Forgotten World. How did Warfro get there? Etc. I guess we'll find this out later when I play Star Allies. Or not. Probably not. I don't know. Who is Morpho? How did he get here? Who knows? We will f- Aww. That is cute. That is cute. They love each other. Uh, it, it, it's basically begging me to go to the arena. Let's go! Yo, everyone is here, and more. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. You mean like that butterfly in the opening of freaking Return to Dreamland? That was an actual character? Is that what you're telling me? I'm pretty sure there was a butterfly in the opening. What the heck? Or what kind of lore are they building here? Bruh, are you kidding me? <laughs> so they made the freaking butterfly and they o I wonder if they planned all this. Or either they planned it all or they had a freaking butterfly in the opening and they were like, you know what, let's make that our villain. <laughs> he's he's actually a bad guy, guys. Not one random butterfly in the opening return to Dreamland. He was the villain all along. <laughs> it just sounds funny to me. I wonder if they were building their lore. Maybe. Who knows with these Kirby people. They're awesome and crazy. Ultimate Cup Z. Yo! You know what that means? I, I was right to wear this shirt. Ultimate Cup Z. We're gonna go Super Saiyan and beat this guy, okay? Super Saiyan. Probably a reference to Kirby Fighter Z, but I don't know. Let's hope I'll have enough stones. In before it needs six, and I'm missing one, and I have to go back. Now this is the one you told me to upgrade, so I will do that. And maybe I'll use it in the arena, since it is the prize I just got. Oh, five. That's a relief. If I was missing one, I'd be really sad right now. Let's do this for one last time's sake, eh? Yo. 
you know, that looks so cool. Except it doesn't give me Morphinite eyes, so I'm a little sad about that, but it still looks awesome. Oh, bruh, okay. Sure. Yo, I'm gonna get his figure. Yo. Yep. This energetic craftsman opened his own weapon shop in Hound. He can power up your copy abilities. All he needs is a blueprint, his trusty hammer, and a little elbow grease. He keeps making headgear for each ball, each bold ability bigger than the one before. That's how you know they're more powerful. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, well. Better get ready for that. I gotta listen to his explanation. Roll really big if you hold down Y to charge to the max. The store has a wider range and a higher attack power at max size. Incredibly powerful. What do you mean normal, Kappa? Yo. Wait, bro, my sword is freaking gigantic. Oh, so they basically just combine, um, gi gi gigant, gi gigant sword and Mennonite sword into one. They combine them. I wonder if I'm missing anything else here. Bruh, this one is so sick. I might use this instead. I don't know. Wait. Oh, okay. It's only five. Let's go. Last time we're gonna see this again. Bruh, wide wall guarding. Okay. I'll try that. Yo, what the? That's freaky. Yo, he's screaming. I don't know if I need these powers, but they are cool. Like, I don't know if I'm gonna use all these, but... Hmm, they might be, like, helpful. I don't know. We'll see. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Ninety-two percent done with the game. We're gonna beef up Kirby right now. Ha, 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 ha. You know, I think I had a Smash Midnight amiibo somewhere, but I don't know what happened to it. Pretty certain I did have one. Do, 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 do. Wait, how? How do I heal? Which attacks? Oh, I don't need that. That's a chump weapon. Waddle why do you give me these things? Oh wait, actually, I shouldn't use all of these yet, because I need to do this though. Let's go, oh, that's what that was. Mm 
Bruh, four minutes? Oh no. Okay, I was gonna say, this has to be really long, right? Oh, it's a boss rush, isn't it? Maybe. Or an enemy rush, at least. This sounds really easy using the super strong power. Oh, it doesn't stay big forever. I see. This has Mario level vibes. When you have to like go to five corners of the freaking level and then do something. So what is the strongest move he has? Is it the big sword? Probably. Slash jump or down slash combo. Oh, so slash. Wait, slash jump. Oh, you mean this? Okay. Oh, slide jump fence. Yeah, I figured that's what you meant. It's all good, babe. I do know about it, I just don't use a lot. Because I just feel like doing everything else is quicker. Ah crap, he's gonna run down my health! You freaking. That is my reaction. Ow. No, my power! You know what? Ah, oh, crap. Hope I didn't waste any time there. Probably not. If so, then I just wasted the health bar and time. Ah, oh, crap. We got lava everywhere. And bonkers. And more bonkers. What is the, with the strong upgrades that give it be fire? First DDD, now this. Dude, 
do 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 Oh, that's a lot of coins. Honestly, I don't think this is supposed to be hard. I guess it's just a nice treat for getting everything. I got the time. Yeah, definitely not. Oh. I was a little bit close, actually, to not doing it. Oh, wow. It makes my dodge faster, huh? Yo. Okay, where's my reward for getting the target type? Nothing. Kappa. Yeah, I know it's nothing. Oh, wow. It's not clear how or why the space called Treasure Road started to appear behind portals throughout the New World. Strong energy was felt from within, and rare stones were soon discovered as its source. Congratulations on collecting all of them. Well, not all of them, because I missed one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know what they mean. They mean from the treasure roads, but like, still, I am mad that I missed it. <laughs> Wait, what is he? What was Elflin talking about? Oh, was he talking about the Colosseum? Well, I guess it's not called the. Oh, really? Yeah, I know, right? He's hiding something from us. This is a Mario Galaxy Star Bits moment. Oh, nice. Bruh. They're hiding lore. Yo. Yo. Now they're really a certified da 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 band. Bruh. It's a local 4D 4D. Bruh. Man, the deedly dees. They love to jam in front of a crowd and start each request off with a wah wah. Let's go, bruh. Now, uh, now I demand an emote of Waddle Dee going, let's go. Except it's wah wah. <laughs> bruh. Except you can't really do that because Waddle Dee doesn't have a mouth. I guess you can just do the eyes. Man meaning- I bet some artists already did that, though. Man meanings at the cafe can get heated due to their different musical tastes, but when the tunes kick in, they fall perfectly in sync. More like, in sync No. Fan humor. I don't even know these yet. Oh, you can play them throughout the town. That's cool. Oh! Okay, instrumental. Cool. Oh, in Kirby's house. Okay, be right back real quick. I just gotta get something. Wait. 
And we heard Leongar was missing. I wasn't sure what we should do. I'm so glad we managed to save him. Now that everyone is safe, I hope we can all make un some kind of unforgettable memories together. You know, the music's better. Oh, bruh. I wasn't ready. I'm glad you like talking to me so much. Say, so I never told you what happened here before you arrived, did I? In the past, all the animals, something, harmony... I mean, we fought every now and then, but... We all tried to share our food and work together. Things were really nice. Then one day, a big scary figure calling himself Bliangar rose to power. Under his rule, everyone started going wild. I got pretty scared, so I went in hiding for a long time, until the Wobbledees started appearing. They were lost and afraid, so I wanted to help them. We eventually decided a town would keep us safe. The first few buildings had just gone up from the animals. When the animals, now called the Beast Pack, found us. We, found, we fought as hard as we could, and in the end, the town was destroyed. Everyone got captured. Oh, so that's what they meant by rebuilding the town. Yes, I guess there was already a town here. Before I got here. That's when you dropped in, Kirby. Thank you so much for saving me back then. I'm so glad I met you. Hope we can go on another adventure someday. Foreshadowing, maybe. My powder crate vortices isn't very strong, but I can open one to pops, play to pop star any time. So no matter what the future holds, I hope we'll always stay friends, Kirby. Aww. Okay, I assume that's it. Um, okay, I'm gonna be right back real quick. Okay, I'm back. More power! Dang, I missed some coins. Bruh. How strong can he be? Oh my god. We're using 3Ds. Aren't we? What the... Oh my god. I am about to max cheese this arena, aren't I? I wonder if there's more I can add to it. Okay. Max cheat. Wait, what if I make Kirby so absurdly fast that it will just be crazy? Um. I 
I mean, I could just... I have to beat a stage to use them again. That's the only thing. Ah. Oh. Okay. Didn't know that. Um. It's only if I clear a stage, yeah. So that's all- <laughs> Bruh. I like how I found that out from beefing for the arena. Well, I got my D to D upgrades, so that's what counts. Pre-arena beefing moment. We are buffing up for this. Oh wait, that wasn't very smart. I need to get my speed upgrade still. Yeah, but I want to be stronger. And faster. I'm gonna make Kirby, like, Sonic speed. For no reason. He will be Sonic fast. I need a speed. Power! Yo, look at him go. Uh, yeah, but have you seen a Kirby go this fast, man? I don't think so. More power! I don't know how much they can stack, by the way. I'm just trying it. More power! Okay, that makes sense. Most Wawa. <laughs> now I'm sure we get the Waddle D Cedar. Most Wawa! Look at this man, he's going sonic speed! Okay, be right back again. Okay. Well, I am full power, full speed. And everything. I don't think so, because it says beat a level, and that's not meaning a level, so... Welcome to the tournament! Coliseum! If you're here to enter a tournament, you came to the right spot. Ultimate Cup Z. Ultimate Cup Z. Challenging? Ha! Huh? Okay. Kirby, I should warn you about the Ultimate Cup Z. The Ultimate Cup Z takes place in some other realm where you face intense battles with scary foes. I can't follow you into that arena. And worse than that, I can't commentate over your battle. But I know you'll survive. No, I know you'll win. After all, you just saved this entire world. True. I'm pretty epic, man. I should probably use the sword. No. We can't follow you into this mysterious arena, but we're watching from here. Wait, they're only giving me tiny tomatoes? Oh no. Good thing I have all these. Okay, let's go. Yo! The dash! Makes me invisible. Wait. Even all this beefing, it didn't make me fully, like, one-shot all the bosses. Oh wait, that just increased the time, not my speed. What was I thinking? I, I was just thinking, just, you know, stacking them up would make me the most powerful god on the planet. What was I thinking? Dang. Well, good to have him just in case, I guess. Health item wise, yeah.
Wait, this is our Kirby GCN theme, kind of. I think they used the same song in Return to Dreamlands Arena, too, but I never got to that, so I don't know. That's true. Oh, I thought it was invincible. Do 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 do. We're fighting tree. Well, ah, oh, you little. Well, the speed will help me here. Bruh. I was so fast that I got past all of his things. Dead. Tree is dead. Bro, you just posted Tree. Dang, I wish I had an extra of those Kirby Amiibos. Though I should be fine. Maybe? Hopefully? Nope. 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 Damn it. Nope. I mean, there's a chance I could have got the sword back, but nope. Damn it. Why can't the arenas just have you keep your ability? That's my question. Nope. Wait a minute. Didn't that ami didn't the amiibo work again after I cleared the freaking um Morphinite Sword Challenge? What if I just did the shortest challenge in the game and then freaking went back and got more Kirby amiibo power? That's a good idea right there. What is the shortest challenge in the game? Treasure World, Star, Freaking Forgotten Land. Oh, yeah. You're right. I didn't think about that. Maybe resetting the game does it. You're, you, you may have a point there. I should try it. Yo... Oh my god. This is so OP. Just saying. Yo, next, you're a genius. Okay. Oh, bruh. Okay, you're a double genius. I'm gonna do this all over again. That is a YTP reference. I'm guessing this will take like 20 minutes or something. Okay, let's go. Oh, we're fighting these guys. I'll be fine. Yo.
Bound. Um. Sorry, next. Did I waste a, more time? I don't know. Oh, damn, Flash without the fork out, so got it. Oh, we're fighting a monkey. Hope the timing isn't too much of a problem for you, but it should be fine. Ah, oh, it doesn't bring me with my big sword. Ah, oh, you stupid monkey. I want to use my sword. Boom. Oh my god, it's so fast. I keep double jumping my accident. Bruh, I just chopped his crotch off. This poor monkey man. The poor guy. Oh, dee dee dee. This is gonna be a fight. I keep getting off with this combo because it wants me to press... B, and then Y. Oh, I think, anyway. Yeah, like that. Oh no! He's about to kill me! Eh, whatever. I have plenty of Kirby's. Ah, damn it. Oh wait, that was a bad idea. Ah, stop knocking out my freaking abilities! Ah, we're finding her again. Let's go. Okay, I should probably put the game a little lower. I don't know. Oh my god, you suck. Yeah, but I have another power-up. So, I thought you wanted me to wait until I use that. Doesn't that make more sense? I don't know. Okay, that was stupid of me. I shouldn't charge her like that. I don't know. I think I misunderstood what, what the plan was here. That's okay, though. I should be fine because I have 100 amiibos. Oh wait, I can't spam all of those though, crap. Because I can only use five. Uh, I guess, but I'd only have one health item, so it'd still be a risk. 
Yeah, I guess you're right. I'm sorry. Yep, no more DDDs or Mennonites. And I can use the two Kirby's that I have, but I don't have any more than that, so I'll have to be careful. Waddle Dee's alright, better than the other amiibo, at least. I used the tomato just in case, because I didn't get to use it last time. Yo. B B Y. I keep, I have to keep remembering that. Hurrah, uh, that was sick. Yo. Tree is about to go down immediately, man. Tree. Ah, you suck. Okay. Boom. Yeah, I know. I'm just being silly. Oh, Meta Knight. Wait, is he gonna be like some abomination? Yeah. Yo, I almost feel bad for you. I wonder if that sword trick to do the old sword works with this bit of die too. This is just a Mario Party minigame. Bruh, he died so fast. I feel sorry for him. Yo, that looked kinda cool. Someone make that a smash hole. Uh, I probably could have used a tomato there. Whoops. Bruh, I'm just smoking them. No, 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 no,
That's okay, I'm smoking him. So I am pulling in awfully close. Oh, I heal. A little bit. Oh god! Bruh. Um, your tomatoes. Oh, thank you. Pink Demon. Yo. I haven't been reading his text, actually. I should I should have been, but it's okay. Nice reference there. Should I use two of them? I will await your answer, because I'm about to fight Lion, and he is strong. How many do I use next? I'm afraid. Three? Okay. I mean... Okay. Let's go. Basically enough. Alright, well I have to fight... Balaju, Balaju! We have to find the butterfly man. Wait. My sword. My my sword. Oh my god. Good thing I got speed, see? I knew I needed it. I could have been doomed there. And I could have been doomed here, I don't know. Boom! Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> so annoying. Also, wait, you didn't want me to use those? Is that what you're telling me? Dang it. I probably just screwed up the whole plan then. What do you mean you didn't want me to use three of them? Oh, okay. Jabbed him in the butt with a sword. Um. Honestly, I kind of want to use them again. Good idea. We're going to fight Phantom Elphilis, aren't we? I'm gonna tell... Oh no, I thought that was me. Dead. Yeah, I'm not too worried. But I'm a little worried.
Yo, what the? That is creepy. Oh, they gave me a free cherry at least. I will not use this immediately, don't worry. This is creepy. Wait, they didn't have a freaking Fender version of um, Forgo Fusion Nightmare. Yo, what the? Yo. Yo, okay. Species born of chaos. Chaos Elphilis. Chaos, chaos! His color scheme reminds me of Okami. Oh, not me, not Okami. His freaking name is Amaterasu, actually. Wait, are you kidding me? I'm way too strong. I am way too strong. Oh my god, what the? Yo. I am way too strong. I almost feel a little bad. I'll probably do this. Eventually, without all these beefy upgrades, like a real man, but, like, I don't know. He's still gonna be a little bit challenging, I think. Boom. Oh, I say a little, but... Thunder waiting right now. Danger! Whoa, what the? That's creepy. Mm -mm 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 -mm. What is he doing? I have to jump over that freaking attack. What's gonna happen to us? All the stuff we take, all the booby rake, all the paid at stake. I see the chaos of risen by who are we? I know the trick now. You and all are the same in that we have a old child and we won't change. Yours is filled with evil and mine is not. There is no way I can lose. Can't hold on much longer, but I won't ever let go. I know it's a one-way track. Tell me how long this will last. I'm not gonna be this way. I didn't even need to use more Kirby Amiibo. Oh, wait. Do, 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 do. I don't know if it's over right now. Open your heart and you will see. Wait. Oh, that's the demon alpha list, isn't it? Wait, what is this? Ah, oh, crap. Of course it's not over. It's his soul- Wait, what the frick? What the French toast? What is this? They did it again. They just scared me by going, And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. <laughs> I'm sorry? Did they just make me lose my freaking sword? Oh my- ow! Jump scare! And here we are! And here we are! It's just an orb! I'm not afraid of you, orb. I thought it'd be something cooler. So there, there might be a phase 3, I don't know. And here we are. Yeah, there's definitely a phase three. He's dying way too fast. Oh my god, okay, this is kind of creepy. A little bit. Oh god. My power. Wait. My power better not be gone. Why? Okay. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. I cursed myself by saying that. Why is the freaking mash button so quick? No! Okay, well, I can still do it. I'm just scared now. 
I'm mildly scared. Oh my god, he just did so much damage. Should I heal now? Oh god, I hate I hate everything. Oh really? Oh god! Kirby! Heal! Oh bro, I'm stupid, okay. Oh god. Oh god, okay, you were right. And here we are. And I squandered my, I squandered my potential. And here we are, and here we are. Oh, I can just suck up all of its little orbies. Okay, it does a lot of damage. So I do have extra Kirby's. One extra Kirby. And we just made the stakes more dramatic anyway. That's a good thing, I think. Dead, I think. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't mean because I'm kind of dumb. I thought I was supposed to just go to the left. That's it? Okay. I did it. I, I, beat, I beat the game, I think. Except for figurines, which I'll eat. Yo. We did it, boys. We saved the world. By the way, it says finale for you, right? On the stream name? Oh wait, no, I never added- Oh wait, yeah, I did. Elphalan! Oh, he's so cute. Cute bean. Oh, wholesome Kirby. Wonderful end to a great game. And how long did it take me? Let's check. It won't tell me because it was only 10 days ago. Damn it. Well, time to check out the Nintendo Switch Online app. That'll tell me, right? Ah, oh, crap. That was loud. My apologies. 12 minutes, not too bad. A champion, a planet pop star has done it. Kirby wins! Well, I wonder what else there is to do now. Yo, okay, that was worth it. Okay. A unique convergence of elements from native beast souls to ethereal butterfly gave a stubborn soul one last chance at revenge. This new creation, driven by pure chaos. Oh wait, so Morpho Knight gave him power? Or Morpho? But new creation, driven by pure chaos, was defeated by the bright light of Kirby's hope. The last bit of life that remained willingly returned to Elphilin. At last, two became one. Oh, so that's what that was. Kirby, you're amazing. You realize that you conquered all the Coliseum tournaments? To honor your landmark achievement in the realm of the arena based comet, I got you a gift. Oh, another one? Coliseum is always ready for battles with brutal beasts. Uh, chaos Elphilus is this for Oxus. True. Because he returns back to Elphilin. Like Roxas. But no one was prepared on a mysterious vortex open inside the arena. Commentator Waddledy was so scared that he almost shut everything down. His curiosity won in the end. What wild battles await within? It's tournament time.
Yo. Wait, do I have all of them? Wait, I thought I did what? Oh, wait. Do I have to get the figure eaten for 100%? Why would I want to use a rare stone? You suck. Wait, what photo am I missing? Yo, the the Waddle Town theme. Yeah, why would I want to freaking trade rare stones? You suck. I'd rather power up all my abilities, even though I already beat the game. Thank you. No. I'd rather trade, like, 1,000 coins. I don't care. I'm not trading my stones. I worked hard for those. It's a stone, Luigi. You don't own it. Oh my god, look at all these guys. Oh yeah, I wonder if I'll have enough money for all these. Maybe I should do that strategy like you said. And just do the newer ones. I am now scissor lift certified! Raise and lower yourself to reach items and dodge enemy attacks. You can also spit the lift out while extending to the top of pole platforms. Well, yeah, but I mean... I'd rather waste my coins on a chance to get newer ones than on a chance to not get newer ones, you know? Oh, that must be a Kirby 64 out of me. It looks like one. Chocolate ice cream bar. Oh. I just noticed I wasn't in me with the camera. Okay. Uh, there. Can you need ride in the new world shortly before Kirby and his friends? It looked like you joined forces with the Beast Pack, but that's no excuse for his mistreatment of the Waddle Dees. His iconic gown seems to have been altered to match his newfound allegiance, and he seems way, way strong. So wait, was he possessed, or did he just join the Beast Pack? I'm guessing possession. I don't think... Loaf of fresh bread. Fire soda cans forward to attack enemies and blast through barriers. Your ammo is limited, so keep an eye out for any cans that can be picked up. Silly Dillo is an incredible dancer, as long as the dance involves spinning. It's a nocturnal critter, so I can see quite well in the dark. It seems to have orders from its boss. I find something important, but all it brings home is junk. What was it supposed to find again? Something small and floaty? Hmm. Silly Dello is a mood. I never really thought about it, but he's literally me. Not just because he's silly, but he also collects random junk. Like, that is so relatable, man. Random junk. Oh, whoops. This illusory beast was created with powerful psychic energy in the realm of dreams. It's not the real Gory Mano, just a phantom made of negative thoughts. But it's still incredibly strong. Since it's based on memories of the real Gory Mano, it can't resist a fruity snack. Yeah, I figured they were all just memory illusions.
Uh, okay, let's keep doing this. How many coins do I have? Okay, stole a lot. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, because I got all the movies. After the town was destroyed, this movie-loving Waldy decided that the cinnamon needed to be rebuilt right away. Sure, food and shelter are important, but so are movies. As for his favorite movie, probably has to be all of them. The Mind Corrupting Mask, The King's Turn to Shine, The Dream Discoveries Tour, The One Who Controls the World, Sudden Metamorphosis, ID F86, Gemini- Oh, that's what that freaking meme meant. <laughs> he's a- he's simply a Gemini man. The ultimate life form. Fate of two worlds. A fill, speed, farewell. No night is eternal. Ending. Entering a dream of isolated isles. Slumbering caged lion. Surging psychic power. Fluttering foe on an isolated isle. Kirby, the beast and the king. True ending. A new species of world consumer. Finding the light. Okay. I'm gonna listen to this theme. Mm -hmm. Endless gotcha, let's go! Endless- I have a crippling gacha addiction. Somebody help me. I like how his eyes are green when he looks at the machine. They're literally beaming off of him. Oh wait, oh, I thought it matched the color of the machine. Or maybe it's from him looking at Elphilin, I don't know. Wait, does he sh does Elphilin shake like three times when you get a new figurine? No. Illuminate your surroundings with the glow from your gold. It's hard to move when you're lit up. So study your surroundings. Go dark again and wobble on more carefully. Uh, okay, come on, we gotta get all of these. No, he just shakes whenever. You know what? The trader Waddledee would have been more helpful if it traded the freaking dupe tokens I have, freaking figurines I have for new coins. Uh, like at least give me like three coins, like games, like a GameStop employee or something. I don't know. Like give me something for all these dupes I have. No crocodile. This robust swimmer has a powerful jaw. It floats on the water surface, watching and waiting for its prey. Tide is that tougher as his armor, so you'll need something bigger than a copy ability to take him down. You think Malfoy Mo would do the trick? Bruh. Cool, cool. Yeah, she is French fry person. It's canon. Uh, we still got a ways to go, boys. Give me something new. Huh. That is not an ear cord. That is a husk of cord. Light ring. Husk of cord. Tub of popcorn. Tub is a popcorn. Get me new figures. Now we can huff and puff out blast of air to blow stand away, defeat enemies, or spin windmills. Um, what about going boats? I guess that's its own figure, though. Yeah, I suppose so. I'm Borgar. 
Balloon Meister loves to do tricks. No one knows where it learned him. Perhaps it's hereditary? Whatever it is, the tricks are fun. Just don't let the ball touch you. Try to inhale it instead to get a bomb ball. Hey, wait, where did it get that ball? Milk bottle. Rabiro and Urabiru? What the heck? Okay, Rabiru and Urabiru. The little one? That's Rabiru. The big one? That's Urabiru. The O is for. Oh my gosh, look how high they can jump. Try not to be on their one when they land. Their fellow critters like to pet them because they're so fluffy. Don't touch the tail, they hate that. I think real rabbits are like that too. Sadness. Get me figures. Yo. Uh, okay. Five more. We gotta do it. Order a sushi. Order of takiyaki. Animal sense. You mean a woofy. Takiyaki just makes me think of a funny scene in Persona 5. I won't say because spoilers. Crappa. Yo. Come on. Or that time crash after I just got crashed. Flowerline tried to cut your adventure short at the Wonderia Circus. She normally acts as a point of contact for the Beast Pack's boss, but she couldn't resist- Yeah, she's a point of contact because she's the girlfriend. But she couldn't resist the chance to track Kirby down herself. Her grace and speed are quite impressive, so the rest of the pack think of her as an idol. She has lots of fans. Bruh, they weren't kidding. kidding. She sure does have a lot of fans. Kappa. Oh no, 50. These precious papers plan- These precious paper plans will show you how to upgrade your copy abilities. Kirby can't do much with them on his own, but a waddle in the weapon shop can use them to dink bonk- Dink bonk bonk. Each ability to be even more powerful. What a skilled engineer. Energy drink. Steak. Pipe mouse Kirby. Get a good forward roll going, and nothing can stop you. Assuming you jump, you time you jumps over your jumps over gaps. Well, that is. Yeah, I'm not quite good at that all the time. Clock ring. They basically just took like every enemy item and freaking character model in the game, and all of those are figurines, pretty much. Like I can't think of a single item they didn't have. That wasn't a figurine. So it's pretty funny. That this literally everything is a figurine. Like, what do you want a figurine of life up in real life? I don't know, but it exists. Imagine, you know, it'd be pretty sick if they recreated some of these, though. Or all of them. I mean, imagine doing gotcha and just getting stairs in real life. Wouldn't you want the stairs figure? I would. Yo, that's sick, man. Hope it's... Hope it's a good steak. Pencil gel. Pipe again. Plate of fried eggs. Ooh, that looks good. Hunk of meat. This game's making me hungry, man. Don't do this to me, Kirby. Wait, what was that called? I always wanted to know what those were called. Breakable block? Really? It's lame. Ice cream cone. Sleep. You know, something I noticed. Were the freaking abilities always just the name of the ability? Because I always thought it was like the ability name and then Kirby. Like Sleep Kirby, Crash Kirby. Bomb Kirby? Like, I don't know. I always just assume that's how it was. But I guess not. The thumbnail's just gonna be figurines, Kappa. Pudding!
Give me a new figurine. I, I have like... 15 more to go. Speakers. Oh no, I'm running low on money, man. I don't know if I'll be able to complete the last one on stream. I'm sad now. But I really want that ending picture on the stream. That would be so cool. Speed boost. Oh yeah! I thought of a real good get rich quick scream. Get, get rich quick scene. Nope, even better than the fishing. Maybe, anyway. Lizard. Oh, it's cute though. I'll fill in with capture by King Nini after the battle at Winter Horns. His cheerful advice, once so common and helpful, was replaced with heavy silence. Don't be sad, Kirby. Aw. Oh. I would be sad if I found that in a stage and I was just like, no, Elphalan. Amiibo! Yeah! I could just spam every single one of my Amiibo. Beat the shortest treasure stage. Which would take like, what, 30 seconds? Or 15 seconds, and then use the Amiibo again. Alternatively, I could open and close the game, but like... I don't know if that's faster than beating a 15 second stage now, is it? Haunting ya. Well, like, I mean, I'll get a lot of coins from it. Stairs Mouth Kirby. Nail. Oh, wait, really? 500? Okay, that's pretty good, but... Oh, I'm almost done with that one, too. I might be cutting it close. Snacker. This ravenous reptile can swallow its enemies whole. Once it spots prey, it'll slither after it as swift as it can. Some of the things it tries to swallow seem unreasonably large, but its stretchy body allows it to gulp them down. Wait, why does that sound familiar? Yeah, I don't want to be on the receiving end of this guy. He's creepy. Oh wait, there's a sleepy a woofy? Aww. The beast pack lives among- AMONG! The remnants of a civilization that left this world far behind. They may not know how to use everything they find, but they always enjoy the simple pleasures. Like the scent of pine that lingers on this Wolfie's favorite napping spot. Move the stairs around to access hard to reach spots. You can also tip yourself over to crush enemies. Wham! Two more. Gimme them. Ah, oh, why I oughta... Handmade Kirby. He's adorable. Someone should recreate that in real life, man. Also, apparently GameStop has freaking shelves that look like Kirby. And I want one of them, because, like... I've heard, uh, they're not at every GameStop. I, I didn't see those at mine. I just saw it on Twitter, and I was like, wow, that's awesome. It's like mouthful mold shelf. It's really cool looking. Now we can start. Okay. Fill your soap up at a water pipe, wobble over to a pack of muck, and spray it away to clear a path forward. Thanks for cleaning up.
Okay. This should not take too long. Um, okay. After their fight with Kirby, ID F86 body was destroyed, but their powerful mind survived. They fled to the isolated isles of their own dreams and brought Liangar with them. With this new vessel, they cast out Liangar's soul, shattering and scattering it throughout the realm of Forgo dreams. The remaining species, alone and incomplete without Elphilin, was trapped in the Eternal Capsule. Their only refuge was the realm of their dreams. Those dreams spread powerful waves of psychic energy all over the world, slowly taking control of the animals they reached. Escape would require more energy. The new world is filled with danger and temptation. Any unexpected detour during your adventure could lead to a mountain of treasure. How many other surprises are hiding out there? There's only one way to find out. And people are resting, I think, so I'm just whispering a little bit. And in a while, Lee and Elphilin have joined Kirby's victory dance. Kirby's dancing is cute and carefree, but his singing voice is super powerful. Let's all sing along with him next time. Woohoo! Great job, Kirby. Okay, come on. When ID-856 arrived, it began attacking all the native wildlife. The creature was captured soon after and turned into a test subject. The native inhabitants used it to create tech beyond their wildest dreams. They eventually used that tech to leave the planet altogether, but F-86 remained. Forgotten and fractured. A full... This foul, the foul fiend standing guard at the bottom of Redgar Volcano was King Nidity again? He told him back down after he removed his menacing mask, so why did he kidnap Elphilin? He said he was being controlled, even before for some strange beast put that mask on him. Okay, come on. How many more of these things are we going? Yeah, okay. Come on, we can do this. A real clover line asked Kirby to help her save Leongar. This phantom feline is a fake. Bruh. Formed from negative thoughts and powerful psychic energy, this wild beast doesn't seem to care about Leongar at all. She may be an illusion, but her claws will cause real damage. The lone illusory foe that you encountered outside of Forgo dreams. When Fector Forgo tried to control Meta Knight like it had King Nidid E. Experienced swordsmen came out on top through sheer force of will. And the result was this mysterious doppelganger or formed by the residual psychic energy. Oh, so it failed. Oh, you can hear the button presses. I was trying to put it closer so you can hear me a little better. Planet Pop Stars Destined Rivals. That's how King Nidini usually describes this special relationship. So he was crestfallen when he was arrived in the new world and couldn't find Kirby. By the time they finally met, Nidini had changed from friendly rival to menace. Brian. Yeah, I found a post about that. It's pretty funny. Ah, crap. How many more of the- okay. Formed from strong psychic energy and model on specific memories of the role in the real world, this the cop and silly Dilla were forever one or four good dreams, searching high and low for Elsalyn and Kirby. At least its dance moves are still impressive. Mennonite arrived in the new world. 
shortly before Kirby. He did some early scouting and reached as far as the snowy north before deciding to return and protect the town. Now he keeps watch for beastly majors from his perch by the Coliseum. He's battled Gory Mondo 30 times, and whatever about. Bruh. He's epic, man. Good for him. This DDD double is made of powerful psychic energy. It's an illusion of the king based on memories of his embarrassing churn under F86 control. Forced to work for Leonar and capture all fluid. There's no memory of Kirby or the adventures they've shared. A little more than a haughty hollow husk. Big rigs. Brad's Venom. I'm a little tired of reading, so I'll just read silently. Couple more left. How more stronger, just like any of these other guys. The last one I got was the woods. We're so close, Phyllis. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, sorry, his name is not actually Leongar. Oh wait, this one was screwed, screwed for like 30 years basically. Is that what they're telling me? That's so sad. Oh, the last one I got was him. That's so cool. Yo, we did it, boys. We did it. Let's go. And I guess that ends off the stream. Thank you, everyone, random viewers, and next for joining. 
It was nice having y'all here, and um, that should probably be it. Let me just look in my house. Okay. Wow. Oh, that's a photo I see now. That's pretty epic. Okay. And we will end it off by sleeping in Kirby's house. He deserves his rest. Our hero. He had a long journey. Anyway, it was fun, and thank you all for joining all of these Kirby streams. Maybe I'll play it again some other time. Who knows? For now, though, farewell.